Our innovation is a sorting device that is used for small rectangular objects, such as books and small packages, that will be in five to ten thousand dollar price range. The innovation will be able to run for one year without fault and have a 100% accuracy rate. Our target audience is libraries, specifically small libraries, and school slash college college libraries. However, the innovation can be adapted to the package delivery and air travel industries. The impact of our innovation will be felt by all librarians as they can eliminate the most labor-intensive process in their lives. The business potential for our product is massive, as the competition is very light as companies like Eurosport and MK Solutions do not have a product as cheap as ours. These companies also have designs that have been called cumbersome and ineffective by the Waikisha Pub Public Library. Our design is a complete change from the traditional book sorter design and aims to streamline the process for libraries around the world. In these scenes, you can see as we're building one of the crates or um, bookshelves that will be in our design, each bookshelf will have approximately 11 books. And here's our CAD design, exampling what the whole product would look like inside of a library with the book chute, conveyor belt, and three different cubbies in order to store all of the books at once. It can move up and down and sort books as the conveyor belt moves. Our first iteration was a circular design that would rotate and spin to each cubbies according to the Dewey Decimal System, and this was our rectangular conveyor belt that would place these books in place. Our final iteration of the CAD model looked as this, and the QR code scanner on each book would help identify which slot to put each book inside the cubbies. Okay. This is the library book sorter. Here's our conveyor belt. Uh, while it is just a representation, it does have a good bit of function to it. It represents the conveyor belt that will feed into the, the sorter itself. As you can see, it has two or one axis of rotation to keep continuity as well as the uh, puller that will remove each of the books out of the cells and here is our book